perpetual calendar is a very well known complication. It's been around for over 150 years. In that time it has almost not evolved at all. For me, always the star of the show is the mechanism. It's all about the mechanism. It's all about, you know, what is the point in creating something which looks amazing, which functions beautifully, which is completely innovative. Why do that and cover it up? I've never understood that. We have combined the parts of the display actually within the mechanism itself. Parts of it are sunk down in. There's no real difference between the display and the mechanisms. The dials now appear to completely float in midair. The aim here was to create a calendar which is foolproof. You can press the correctors whenever you like, you can manipulate it any way you like, whatever you do, you're not going to break anything, you're not going to damage anything. With the conventional system, where you've got everything based on 31 days, you're always obliged to move through the 31 days, even if you don't use all 31 days. I wanted to create a calendar which will jump precisely from the last day of the month, be that 28, 29, 30 or 31, jump from that directly to the first with no hesitation or passing over unwanted days. And this we managed to achieve. It's been a brilliant way to realise an idea which I've had in my head for a long time.